to the base. I then inserted the threaded shaft into the retention nut on the carriage assembly and inserted the two 8mm shafts into the linear bearings. Turning the threaded rod now causes the carriage assembly to move a power connector to the board with wires, following the connection instructions printed on the front of the board. I finally cleaned up the wire routing with a few more zip ties, and the 3D scanner was utilization period, the scan was underway. The time it takes to scan an object depends on the parameters in the Arduino code, such as desired angular resolution, number of scan samples per reading, and amount of time to pause between each rotation of the turntable. In this video, the object...